What? Oh, it's just some of my stuff has gone missing. Wait, someone's been taking something from you? Well, nothing. I'm, I'm probably overthinking it. No, no. What is it, Dad? It's just a lot of my socks and underwear are gone. I s don't think you know anything about that, do you? <laughs> do you think I did it? That's ridiculous. I mean, what would I gain from that? Well, they're, they're pretty nice underwear. You know who I think did it? The gnome. He's scary, I'm telling you. I don't trust him. Don't be ridiculous, Oliver. You love gnomes. What about Charles Gnomesworth? No, Charles Gnomesworth is different. He's given me good rest and comfort for 17 years now. If he started to gain consciousness and started moving around, he wouldn't try and kill me. But Sherlock Gnomes? Haha, ha, very funny, Oliver. I'm sure he means no harm by it. O Oliver, did you hear that? It sounds like Sherlock Gnomes is saying, I'm sorry, Mr. O'Malley. I didn't mean any harm. Right. Just keep an eye out. That's all I'm saying. Oliver, don't you want to finish your dinner? Yeah, I'm full. Can you put it in the fridge for me, please? Sure thing, kiddo. What are you doing? I'm putting him outside. I know you love him, but you'll be thanking me when your socks and underwear stop going missing. Okay, but I'm telling you, this is ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. Ridiculous. I'll be right back, Charles. I thought I told my dad to leave you outside. <laughs> huh? 
Hello, Oliver. Did you just... I can't believe it. I thought you might be on to me. I just thought it would take you a little longer to figure out the truth. You mean... That's right, Oliver. I'm the one behind the underwear and the sock stealing. But why? Simple. I want to cause confusion. Little by little, I tear down the confidence you have in your memory. And then I start stealing more valuable things. Like t-shirts. Pants. Why? Because it gives us gnomes a good chuckle. Seeing you accuse each other. When your dad thought you were the one who stole his underwear at dinner. It took a lot of effort to hold the giggles back. I mean, seriously, that one's gonna go down in the history books. Okay, enough about the underwear. Oliver. I don't think you truly understand how absolutely hilarious this is to us gnomes. I mean, we're really committed to it. It's just... it's really, like, not that funny. It's okay. Oliver, you're trying to stop my shenanigans. And that's enough to drive a gnome to madness. No! Sherlock gnomes! Please don't! Gnomes! I can't take it anymore! Get off of me! Never! Oliver? 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 I'm here, Oliver! I'm here! Time's up, Sherlock. Charles Gnomesworth is here. Charles! Yippee! Punch! Ah! Ah! Why, Charles Gnomesworth? Why betray your own kind? Because Oliver has given me good rest and comfort for 17 years of my life. And... and I love him. But you had to give up the shenanigans. How can a gnome truly be happy without stealing minuscule things from people and watching them look around in confusion? Oliver, it's worth it. But... It's time for your underwear stealing to come to an end, Sherlock Gnomes. Goodbye, Sherlock Gnomes. I hope it was worth it. Oh, trust me, it was worth it. I'm sure he's laughing in his grave. You know, you really do underestimate how hilarious we find this stuff. I'm sure I do. Come on, let's go to sleep. Let's. Oh, trust me, Oliver. It was worth it. Hehehehe. <laughs>